We are Africans, not because we are born in Africa, but because Africa is born in us. Art means everything to me. It means everything. With art, it's a different kind of communication. I feel like there's a lot of other artists out there who are black and who are shattered, who have no space to, to actually express themselves in whatever way. I am a physical if you are a dancer, you have to be versatile. You can't be a dancer and then you say, ah, you drive steady C1. It dances. Basically, CB is a good techno fusion. So we're mixing all the genres. Coming from like a Vogue, Pantola, hip hop, Kwasa Kwasa. I mean, for art, the way you say it's our call, it's the way you express some things that I'm going to call. No man, I'm going to say, if you're a specialist, you're going to say, it's there. You know that thing, there. I realized that I have so much love for arts growing up and I wanted to like, um, I wanted to continue and find myself in that and make a career out of it. It's important to actually express yourself in whatever way, like irrespective of your, the color of your skin or being a woman or anything. I've been through challenges of, of having to be in in white uh, dominated spaces and trying to present my work as an artist or myself as, as a being, but um, I haven't been taken seriously. I'm more of an expressive uh, artist and um, I observe a lot of people and their they, they they characters and how they actually perceive themselves and I try to put that in my work as well. I try to incorporate all of that in my work. My name is Alka Malindisa. My name is Dumela Khwate, also known as Systematic DJ. I can call myself an artist. I'm a creator and I'm an appreciator, if there is such a word, of my surroundings, my environment, color, nature. My art is unique because I have a reference, like a worldwide reference of, of cultures. Growing up, all you used to do was watch American music videos. So you have an understanding of, of their culture. You watch European films and, you know, cultures of other worlds. So when you, when you have that as a reference and you have your own culture that's around you, I think you have more to give, you know, because you, you can put that together and create something even greater. There are so many mediums competing for, for our attention, competing just to, you know, to, to shape how we think, to benefit them, you know, because if we think in a certain way, if we think as Africans we are inferior, it benefits somebody else. So there is somebody that will orchestrate a way for us to, to be stereotypes, to look at ourselves and think, ah, oh, I, I need to be lighter, or I need, I need to be different. I, I cannot be accepted by the world the way I am. Big Black is, is powerful. Like, we, we, we're with the black skin, we're more creative, since we, we contain uh, an element called melanin that, that makes us uh, reach, like, um, deep inward our creative mode. As an artist, I believe that being black is a privilege. It is what I carry with me. It's, it's my inheritance. It's, it's my essence. It's, it's who I am. I'm an African. My art, my Africa. My Africa, my art. Booyah, Africa, booyah! Booyah!